Zimbabwe. Elections are coming up next year, as you guys know. And yes, Mugabe is campaigning again. The man means business. He's going all around uh, Zimbabwe, you know. <laughs> of course, 37 years is not enough. Who says 37 years of presidency is enough? I beg, I beg. So there's a huge pressure now for Mugabe to name his successor. In fact, his wife. His wife is also one of those people asking him to name his uh, successor. Although, <laughs> she's not hiding the fact that she wants to be the next president of Zimbabwe. In fact, not long ago, the thugs of Grace Mugabe, they staged a beating of an opposition member wearing the t-shirt of opposition leader. And in that video, they beat up the guy, they ordered him to take off his t-shirt and to wear Zano PF's t-shirt. And then they made him bow down and pledge allegiance to the picture of Grace Mugabe. Eh, can you ima can you imagine? Did you guys notice that was the picture of Grace Mugabe? It wasn't even the picture of Mugabe. Anyway, the video was staged. That's why they didn't really beat up the guy. But they circulated this video, you know, via um WhatsApp and so on, so that people would be afraid of identifying with the opposition. The aim was to make people afraid. So, yes, there are so many vehicles with Grace Mugabe's picture. So, of course, we know that she's not hiding the fact that she wants to be the next president. Now, talking about this election, uh, Mugabe, who is 93, wants all Zimbabweans to know, by the way, that he is still the only person fit for the job. And I'm not kidding. The man is saying, in case anyone out there thinks that Mugabe is becoming weak or fragile, he has a message for all of you. Well, there is the issue. If we are the president is going I'm not going the president is dying I'm not dying tell them Muga tell them Baba Mugabe eh? I hope you had him well you know all of your enemies of progress ah! the man said he's not dying ah! He is not dying. In fact, he said that his doctors told him that he's now stronger than before. According to Mugabe, the doctors are saying that his bones are now stronger. You know, I'm telling you, the older you get, the stronger. I don't know why some of you, the older you get, the weaker you become. Mugabe at 93, the doctors are saying that his bones are now stronger than when he was younger. In fact, I've been telling this one, I've been telling all oh, that Mugabe is probably stronger than you. Eh? <laughs> What is this? Why? Hey, Fanta, what is this? This is an abomination. Was somebody trying to slap Mr. Pre Abba? Was he trying to slap Mr. President? No, no, no. This must be an error. The man was probably trying to kill Mosquito. Yes, that he must be trying to kill Mosquito. If you do your investigations very well. Ah, nobody would dare to slap eh, stronger Fit as a fidu, stronger than uh, the man is stronger than you. <laughs> Just because I said he's stronger than you, you are tripping, you are tripping, you are a troublemaker. Anyway, the man is fit as a fidu, and maybe the bodyguards were just trying to kill mosquito. Anyway, elections are coming up next year, as you guys know. And my people of Zimbabwe, let me just say that I know that it's not going to be funny, but this is actually an opportunity for you to allow Mugabe to rest. Let the man rest. Ah, has he not tried? Is it not enough? 37 years of one man's uh, government. Let the man rest. And please, let Grace also rest. You need to let the woman rest as well. Grace Mugabe, the woman talks a lot. But hey, you guys know I don't know much. Guess what? I'm just keeping it real. <laughs>